Hello everyone, it's Tim and welcome to the first installment of my short videos breaking down the facial signs of just two uh, mineral deficiencies or tissue salt deficiencies today that being calcium carbonate and selenium. This 53 year old lady in the photo and please understand that this photo is exaggerated the skin is magnified in this photo. This is not really what her skin looks like. But for the purpose of educating you, I am going. I have. I have done this. Uh, but first, let's talk about the calcium carbonate deficiency. And you, here are the signs. Right, the two. The skin hanging above the upper eyelids has gone down, and it's actually covering not just the upper eyelids, but the eyeballs itself. This is a very extreme case, and not. Uh, something that is typical. A typical uh, sign of deficiency would be the skin hanging just to cover the upper eyelids. When it's covering just the upper eyelids alone, you have a moderate uh, calcium carbonate deficiency. When it comes to selenium, and this is going to be very important to you people with thyroid disorders, uh, we have to look at the indents at the sides of the bridge of the nose, right with the, at the inside corners of the eyes. In this photo, you'll see very deep, uh, concaved indents on each side, as if somebody poked, poked it with a round, round object, and the indent stayed at the sides of the nose. This again is a selenium deficiency, and selenium is required. It is a cofactor of T4. The conversion of T3 to T4 requires selenoproteins, derived of course from selenium, in order to make the conversion. So you can expect issues. But again, if you have an autoimmune disorder, selenium is an immune booster. You cannot take an immune booster if you have an autoimmune thyroid disorder. If you do, you will be provoking the attack of the immune system upon your thyroid. As with any autoimmune disorder, that is exactly what an autoimmune disorder is. It is an attack of the immune system on the body. You cannot boost that immune system or you boost the attack. But here are the two, the two uh, signs of uh, mineral deficiencies or tissue salt deficiencies for today. Calcium carbonate is the hanging skin above the upper eyelid that will typically just cover the eyelids. And selenium, the sides of the bridge of the nose, we have sharp or rounded indents at the inside corners of the eyes, again against the sides of the bridge of the nose. A very extreme case in both cases. It does not have to be this prominent. But these are the two signs to look out for for these deficiencies. That's all for today, folks. See you in the next video.